Welcome to Vacuum Wars and to our review of the Armorall 2.5 horsepower wet dry car vacuum. We recently did a video on the best car vacuums of 2023, and the Armorall came in third overall, which is really good when you consider it was so much cheaper than the other winners. So we wanted to give it the attention it deserves with a full review video. Starting off with the specs and features, the Armorall comes with a hose, a reusable cloth filter, a foam wet filter, a two in one utility nozzle with a brush a detail brush, a crevice tool, a blower nozzle with an adapter, and a deluxe car nozzle. Attachments are key to making a good car vacuum, and we were really impressed with how well thought out the Armorall's attachment set is for car detailing. The deluxe car nozzle is the perfect shape for car cleaning. It's the same basic shape that you would see on professional car vacuums, and it's amazing how few car vacuums don't come with an attachment like this. The super small detail brush is a real game changer when it comes to reaching hard to clean cracks and crevices in cars, especially on dashboards, vents, and electronics. It also has convenient onboard accessory and hose storage, so you can keep all your attachments with the vacuum. It has a built-in air and noise diffuser and scored about average for noise level compared to the other car vacuums we tested. Its size and weight were both well below average, making it much more convenient to use and transport. Its cord length is 10 feet, which is about 2 feet below average, but it's not a big deal since most people will probably use an extension anyway. Its hose management was better than average because of the built-in accessory and hose storage. A really helpful feature of some car vacuums is a hose swivel, which means that the hose can turn independently of the vacuum, making it much easier to maneuver and use in different positions. The Armorall has not one but two hose swivels, one at the handle end and one at the base end. Only two others we tested had swivels, and it's something that makes a big difference when you're vacuuming in tight spaces like a car. It also has a blower as well as a suction port and can easily be converted to a blower for different tasks. It can be used as a wet vacuum for water-related tasks. It failed the filtration test, but so did all of the other car vacuums that we tested. Moving on to the power tests and pickup tests. Suction is one of the most important metrics for car vacuums because you're usually using an attachment more or less sealed to the upholstery. However, airflow is also important, so we measured that too to get a sense of its overall power. It performed well in our pickup tests, where we tried to simulate different conditions you might encounter when detailing your car. It also did very well in our real-world test, where we tested its ability to pick up embedded debris from car upholstery, where we found that the small brush was a game-changer for getting hard-to-reach places. Finally, we looked at its current price compared to its online reviews, and this is what really put the armor all ahead of its competition. It's one of the cheapest car vacuums out there, but it's also one of the best, so it's got a lot of value. Overall, the Armor All is an excellent buy for someone who's looking for a budget-friendly option that also has power, convenience, and one of the best attachment sets of all the car vacuums that we've tested.